right here. Okay. We're gonna storm that bunker. Fast enough. They won't see you. Victoria in Seattle attacked our western borders. We fought together on the front lines. Wave after wave of infantry smashed their way through our defenses. The suns kept in constant formation, sweeping the streets, burning and grinding the gears of war. When our squad was hit by an ambush, he gained rank and became a guiding force. We dug in, put our faith in him. For days they rained down small arms and firebombs. But because of him, we made it through. But not without consequence. He was captured and tortured. By the time we found him, he was never the same. War had changed him. I didn't see the madness building in his eyes or the hate. When I look back now, I can see it. 
Sergeant Murrow Ramses of the Intercontinental Army. He was my brother. Him and his men left me with nothing but a set of footprints leading into the wastes. I'd say he has at least 30 men with him. Maybe more. While I was in the army, I heard rumors of a massive radiation signature coming from way out deep. He was always consumed with the idea. Some kind of hydrogen weapon. However, by the sources I've seen, it could be something much more powerful. Where's Ramses? Ramses over there. Ramses dead. Now I'm sure you've noticed. I'm not a man to play games. It wouldn't like that. <coughs> Won't kill you quickly. It wouldn't like that. It's gonna fester. Take a couple days to work through you. Chances are they'll call the coyotes. Or you can lay out here and cook in the sun. Your best bet is to tell me where my brother is. 
and I'll see about making a quicker road to hell for you. I, I don't know. <laughs> he, he went out of the desert. <laughs> I heard stories. You go that way, you don't come back. <laughs> Kill me, you son of a bitch. Kill me! You don't have any objections with me taking a look at that kid over there. Don't think you'll be needing it with you. Die and all. You're one man. He's got a fucking army. You don't stand a chance. <coughs> you know that wife of yours? <coughs> she begged me. She begged me to stop. said your name, I, I don't know how many times. could bring them out this far. Can't say I care much what it is. But the plot points on this map lead straight into no man's land. Deep into the wastes. Hundreds of miles of nothing but heartache and desperation to lead his men into that kind of wilderness. He must want it bad. Fall back. Merle!
great fire painted the skies a crimson shade, leaving charred remains at my feet. I realized this nation was doomed to fail, but I kept fighting. We had sworn an oath to the Intercontinental Army. Then news came. The suns were moving towards my hometown, sweeping and murdering a few cities away. I had no choice. I had to desert the army and find my wife. My brother didn't see it that way. His eyes were on fire when I left. I begged him to come with me. And he called me a coward. I told him if he changed his mind, he knew where to find me. He said nothing and watched me go. By the time I broke free from the maelstrom, most of our platoon was dead. And our army was crumbling. After years had gone by, I thought I had lost my brother. Another casualty to a war that changed the world. And that became the seeds for his revenge. I paid a terrible price.
These cannibal, wild men, growing up after the fires of war. No sense of decency left. Just scavengers of an old world. The chances of me walking out of this just plummeted. searching for my wife. War had left nothing but ash and death in its wake. I knew that there was a slim chance I would find her alive. But I had made a promise to Hannah years prior. If she was still alive. I knew where she would be. so tight. I wish that moment could last forever. Out of all the destruction I had her to hold on to, I could see all the loss Hannah had been through. The death of so many people that she had loved. I told her about my father's cabin, how we could start a new life. I saw the hope once again return to her eyes. Backing up. Yeah, keep backing up and throw them guns down. I can't do that. Now we have that shooter pointed at me. Why are you following us? Us. Who else is out here with you? Me and the cats, smart guy. Why are you following us? To tell you the truth, I didn't know who I was following. You dragging around that cat carrier makes a mighty strange track. I didn't know what I'd find. I think I'm just gonna shoot you. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, look. The way that I got it figured is you got me dead before I raised my barrel up. But you'll also notice, I also have my shooter pointed right at Mr. Kitty over there. Stay away from that cat! Now I'll be backing up. I was just curious is all. I haven't seen very many people out here. Don't suppose you tell me who the hell you are, how you've been surviving out here. I didn't think so. I'll be on my way. I'll leave your gun up on the top of the hill. You're just leaving? Yep. Where are you going? 
I'm looking for someone and you're not them. So I'll be on my way. I'm looking for someone too. My sister, she disappeared a couple days ago. There's a town up north. Maybe the someone you're looking for is there too. That town isn't safe. They'll get to you and not think twice about it. You'd be wise to steer clear of that hellhole. But what about my sister? What does she look like? Really pretty with, with blonde hair. I have a photo. I did see someone like this a couple days back. There was nothing I could do for them though. They were already dead. Are you, are you just are you just saying that to get a rise out of me? I'm afraid not. Her throat was cut. Looked like it was a mercy when it happened. I'm sorry. She was as out of place as the tracks she was leaving in the sand. It would have been a mercy to put a bullet in her. Save her from the agony that lies ahead. Her supplies might have been useful. Or a waste of a bullet. Anyone dumb enough to aimlessly wander the desert will surely pay the price. It's a wonder that she's lasted this long. like worried fire. I always go back to that place. It comforts me. My chair. My favorite coffee mug. The way that picture would sit crooked on the way to our bed. The sound of the pine trees that would sway in the breeze. <laughs> I memorized that place. Every inch of it. I'd walk those steps in my mind over and over again. That lovely island of isolation high in the mountains where we made a life for ourselves. One filled with love and hope. Five years passed. My wife gave birth to our son. After all this world had shown me, I knew I had found my way home.
I'd give anything. Killed a pagan in this arm. Shot a whiskey. A mercy bullet. The fever setting in. I'd lost a trail. I'm not sure if I'm anywhere close to the coordinates on the map. Lost in the desert. Can't focus. Been seen double for the last two days. And I'm just guessing at this point. Compass is all that separates me from being buried out here in the sand. And it's no longer pointing north. Pain shoots through my body with each step. Shriveled nose, cracked eyes with blood, face down in the dirt. This is what lies ahead. It won't be long now. Gave up on following each other. I could just shoot you right now and get it over with. What happened to you? Are you sick? Okay. <clears throat> That wound on your arm, it's infected. You should really let me help you. I'm sure you know what this is. I'll help you under one condition. Give me some of what you were eating last night. It smelled pretty good. <sighs> it's scrawny. Fill the belly. You built the fire. Thank you, Anna. I'd start by heading towards those mountains over there. Go until you find the river, then follow it downstream. Why would I want to do that? Because you're bound to find somebody. I already found someone. way. Apparently a coincidence we're both here. Is that so?
This certainly looks like the work of the men I'm aiming to run into. What do you want with such people? It's a trap! Go, go! shot one of them. Where's the body? It's a good question. No shells. No tracks. They just disappeared. Doesn't make any sense. I've heard of seeing ghosts in the desert. But those bullets, they were real enough. comfortable with the idea of spending the rest of my days at that cabin. Thought I could leave this world behind. I didn't see it then. How wrong I was. I always told her it was going to be okay. I was lying. To us both. I didn't want any of the nightmares in this world to touch her. I thought we had found home. In the end, I was wrong. What was she like? you're thinking about. You can tell. She was kind. Would've done anything for My sister would do that too. Drift away. She'd dance around the room and dream of these far away places. Beach, hot sun on her skin, her fancy restaurant with gourmet food on the plates. Call them the warm places in her mind. 
she started to look for those places and it got the best of her. Sorry for your loss. What your brother did to you was horrible. You're a good man. You can just With all due respect, darling. You don't know what you're talking about. Or how good I am or not. Why are we stopping? Get your ass down. Jesus, who are you shooting at? Damn it. What? I just winged him. Come on, let's go. Move it, come on! He's over here. Looks like he's hurt pretty bad. His troubles will be over soon enough. You may want to look the other way, darling. Uh, you can't shoot him. Why not? Because he's defenseless. <laughs> that isn't any kind of excuse. He has this coming. You know, he might be more help to you alive. You said you were looking for all the soldiers, right? He might be able to tell you where they are, but he can't do that if he's dead. Uh, he's unconscious, shot in the belly. He'll bleed to death before he even wakes up. Shooting him at this point is a mercy killing. I don't think the bullet even went that far in. Feels like it bounced off a rib or something. This one's gonna bounce off the back of his skull. Get the hell out of the way! No! All right. You stay here and watch him die.
Did you really think you could kill us all? No, just you. Get up. What? You gonna shoot me in the back? Those tribals, they come to this place to sacrifice. It's surrounded by some kind of energy field. The skulls serve as a warning. They worship what lies beyond. Now start walking. Fire's almost out. Maybe I should just stand here and watch you freeze to death. Take my compass off your dead body. I felt inclined to say hello. Uh, hello. You have something that belongs to me. What's going on? I don't associate with his kind. I best be leaving before I start shooting. No, don't go. They kidnapped him three months ago and made him ride with them. He's just as much a victim in this as anyone. How do I know? He didn't cook up some story to save his ass. I don't feel inclined to sleep next to you either. Who knows what you'll take from me next? I only took it so he'd come back. You chose to stay with him. You chose to stay here and die. Don't put that bang on me! You could save me from my ignorance. If you were the gentlemanly sort. Good thing I'm not thusly inflicted then, isn't it? So is he dying or what? I mean, the bleeding stopped, but... I don't know. Well, how about it, you son of a bitch? Don't you? Don't you? Please. Don't you? Don't you? He's not one of them, you know? Those men you're after. It's true. It's true, sir. I'm not. A couple months ago, they got my brother and I. They, they killed my folks. Took all the supplies I needed, burned everything else. So why didn't they kill you, cat me? The, the head guy, Ramsey's. He's after something. And he, well, he, he told us we could be soldiers. He said he'd train us. It's awful what they made us do. Ramsey's tried to make my brother and I kill each other. He said one would die, the other would get to eat. And uh, that night, my brother 
So you killed him. See? You're not the only one in some sorrow. You shot the poor kid. Yeah, and I might shoot him some more if I don't like what he has to tell me. Might shoot you too. Save me a world of trouble. I ran away. They didn't even bother following me. Why do you suppose that is? I'm not really sure Ramsey's is after something. I don't even think he knows what it is himself. Something kind of out of the ordinary. Something supernatural, kind of godly. Heard guys around camp talking about it. Talking about when you get near, they kind of go a little bit crazy. Kind of lose their mind a little bit. Shooting at men out in the wilderness. Them just disappear, no bodies. We head that way tomorrow. I don't like the fact I'm being followed by these two. I should let them fall asleep and gut them both. Save some heartache. But I have to admit, it's not all bad seeing another face. Just, oh, just, just wait a minute. Even if it is a sad excuse for a woman and a piss poor soldier, these are cold blooded, battle hardened soldiers. My current company won't stand a chance. I was shooting at you. Take a man's livelihood and then come back to finish a job? Well, do it if you're gonna do it, you cowards! What is he blabbering about? Hard to say. Give him some space. Now, why don't you tell me what the hell you were talking about? And I'll decide whether or not I shoot you. Him and his buddies. Some sort of soldiers come across me and my wagon. I got away, but they took everything except my gun, and, and now I'm damn near out of ammunition. Be more likely to hit what you were aiming at if you use it as a club. How long ago was this? Ask your friend. I'm asking you, friend. Better stop talking before I lose my patience. A few days ago, one of them said they was gonna come back and well, I saw that uniform and figured you'd just come back to finish me off. That uniform does attract gunfire. I can assure you, it wasn't amongst those men that you speak of. And if you think that makes me feel any better, you, sir, are sorely mistaken. You desert bandits are all alike. You can take my gun, I ain't got any food. You seem miserable enough as it is. I'm gonna keep the gun for a while though, before I give it back. I guess we may camp here tonight. See what I can do about finding some food.
What are we gonna do about the old timer? Well, I figure, let him run his mouth for a minute or two more, then I shoot him. Even though I said I wouldn't. That fire started, I'll be back. I haven't sorted this all out myself, but maybe, maybe a power, maybe someone or something greater than, greater than man keeps an eye when we become too destructive or, or too powerful, steps in and stomps us down to nothing and leaves a few of us to, to, to rebuild and, and forget. That's nonsense. You believe what you want. That's what I heard. And that doesn't sit with me well either. But there's something else happening here now, that's for sure. So, all of this, because of a tall tale? Now, I know this area wasn't heavily populated, but there were, there were cities and, and there were towns. And they're gone, just gone. Even the big cities, when a, after the riots and the fires, there's evidence of some settlements, but they are gone. It's like they never existed in the first place. I mean, there are very few people left. And maybe a power that is greater than man is, is cleansing the earth of, of evil. I think we found ourselves a true believer this time. You gonna add this one to your collection too? I wanna hear what he has to say. Yeah, of course you do. You're insane too. Oh. I like an appreciative audience. <laughs> you're the only one that's lost something. Me and that soldier, who have we got? You've heard the stories. You know if you go marching out there after your brother, you're not coming back. And what's it gonna do if you do kill him? It's not gonna change anything. You've got a chance here to do something good. We can go with the old timer and find one of those towns he's been talking about. We can all help each other out. We can start over. There was a time. That would have been a real good offer. And you're right. There is no need for you or that boy to come with me. But what would your wife want? The old man was nuts, no doubt about that. But he seemed the best and only choice for those two. He could get them to one of those towns he spoke about. Lead them away from whatever awaits me over that ridge.
They were shooting in all directions. Whoever hit these men had the numbers to do it. More ghosts in the desert. Where's the rest of you men? What the hell's wrong with you? Look at me. Look at me. Most of your weapons, brother. Nice and slow. Seems like a lock move. and slow, soldier. So you and I, we're gonna finish the mission. My men didn't die for no reason. Him over there, he's been like that for three days. It's like they're all gone inside. I'm sure by now, you realize that things are a little bit different around here. He hasn't talked, hasn't eaten. Everything starts to seem different. He hasn't even taken his fucking mask off. The closer we got to it, the more they all started acting crazy. And even then on
You got that shit in your head. You're losing her just like the others. You almost killed me! That wouldn't be the first time. Where did you come from anyway? I've been following you for the last few days. You should have stayed with the old man. Give me my gun. No, I think I'll hold on to it for a while. No. I only have three bullets left. What the hell do you want with my gun anyway? Why do you think I'd blindly follow the same son of a bitch who put a bullet through my side? I don't know. Maybe you touched in the head. You act like you're the only one that's got something to fight for. I'm going after Ramsey's. I'm going with or without you. You sure that's a wise idea? You know what I'm up against. They killed my brother. They killed my whole family. I'm going. All right. Stop pointing that thing at me. set up. They hear those gunshots. A whole lot will be after us. We can do this by hand. We move fast. Silent. What the hell are you doing out here in the middle of hell anyway? Something's in the mouth of this canyon. 
something that changes you. Gets inside your mind. I think you know what I'm talking about. You've seen it too. It drove some of the men mad. I'm not sure what it is. But I know it's connected to those crazy sons of bitches that managed to take out most of my men. They seem to be protecting whatever's out there. And their numbers are growing. You can't seem to kill them, can you? I don't know. I really didn't try that hard. Well, I did. They've all mutated somehow. They act more like animals than people. We found one of the bodies after they attacked. It was horribly disfigured. He was one of the sons, a captain no less. They must have discovered something out there or built some kind of weapon. I don't care what's out there. You've been crazy long before all this. So what exactly do you have to gain from it? Some of the brains back home. They think this could be a source of real power. Power that could change the world. Oh, really? Well, what is it then? No one's seen it yet. No one's been close enough. But it is powerful. That's for sure. Man gets a hold of that. He could be the next ruler of the world. And I'll make sure you're dead before that happens. You were so pathetic, calling to her like you were, like some maimed animal needing to be put down. So I did what I had to do, and I bashed your brains in. Looks like my blood was light. Must have been because your family and all. And I'll see you dead before this is over. I think you could try. You will pay for what you did, Merle. Now you've come here for revenge? I don't think that's why you're here. I think you're here for me to put a bullet right between your eyes. How about it? Just a squeeze of the trigger, then you get to see your family again. Isn't that what you want? If you're gonna shoot me, to get it over with.
saw your brother slipping off when the savages attacked us. Me and the kid tried to tail him. Which way did he go? He went up over that ridge, right between those rocks, right there. I need you guys to go. He's out there by himself with these things chasing him. Let him find his own end. You don't know my brother. This is something I gotta do. You got nothing left to prove. He's as good as dead anyway. I need you guys to go. Now! No. That's the way Ramsey went. That's the way I'm going, whether you like it or not. I tried to keep him safe. I tried to lead him out of here and keep him safe just like you said. Now I know you did. Okay. I'll see you guys soon. You go. Go! his hide. Son of a bitch. Why didn't you wait for me? Colin, you need to rest. I'm gonna get you out of here. Maybe that old timer can fix you up. No. Get him.
It's over. The anomaly is just over that rise. Finish me off. And all that power is yours. Not much has been in my mind, except ending your worthless existence. I'm done with revenge. You're not worth the extra ammo. You lose any more blood, there ain't nothing on this earth or anywhere else that will bring you back. You mean to tell me you're not just a slightly bit interested? What's over that ridge? Uh, I sacrificed everything to get here. It's only 50 yards. You could change things in this world. Make a difference. There's some things better left alone. That's something you never understood. You ain't gonna hurt anybody else. Neither are your men. You're just gonna leave me out here? Not even give yourself? The satisfaction of revenge? Yeah. I reckon so. 